we know that black women in America are three to four times more likely to die in relation to pregnancy and, and childbirth than anyone else. And it is completely avoidable. We have to avoid it by recognizing what causes these outcomes. And when you look at it, you realize that it's not a function of this woman's educational level. It's not a function of this woman's socioeconomic level. When you look at the issue, and you don't have to scratch the surface deep enough to figure out really quickly, it is literally because of her race and because of the implicit bias that is in the medical health professions that results in that woman not being taken seriously when she walks into the clinic, when she walks into the hospital, when she walks into the doctor's office and she explains what's hurting her, what is ailing her when she complains about the things that are giving her pain, she is not taken as seriously. Recognizing this is about implicit bias, um, I decided to do something about it. We wrote a bill that um, acknowledges the fact of implicit bias and then seeks to address it by specifically requiring that medical schools, nursing schools teach these soon to be professionals about um, their bias so that we can as much as possible eliminate bias from the system and ensure better outcomes for women um, and in particular black women in the medical health profession.